the taming of the shrew the taming of the shrew is a comedic play written by william shakespeare created sometime between 1590 and 1594 and it was first published in the first folio of 1623 the play revolves around the spirited courtship between katharina or kate known for her fiery temperament and the clever petruchio who is determined to win her over and secure her dowry The primary storyline follows the wooing of Petruchio and Katharina, the strong-willed and feisty shrew. At first, Katharina is far from interested in the relationship, but Petruchio employs various tactics, including psychological strategies like depriving her of food and drink to tame her. Eventually, he transforms her into a desirable, compliant and obedient bride. Alongside this, A subplot unfolds involving the competition among suitors for the affections of Katharina's younger sister Bianca who embodies the societal ideal of a woman. The question of whether the play holds misogynistic undertones has sparked extensive debate especially among contemporary scholars, audiences and readers. Major characters. The action revolves around Catherine or Kate the daughter of Baptista and the older sister of Bianca. Catherine has no suitors because she is not conventionally attractive. Still, more seriously, she is notoriously shrewish and seems to hate men, which makes it difficult for any man to deal with her. Bianca is sweet-natured and beautiful but cannot marry until her older sister does. Petruchio is a gentleman from Verona who agrees to marry Catherine because of her large dowry. The action is mainly concerned with his efforts to tame her. Lucentio, a young man from Pisa, falls in love with Bianca because she cannot marry. Summary of the play. So, the taming of the shrew kicks off with this dude Sly, who is pretty sloshed. Some fancy noblemen mess with him and make him think he is a lord. They even give him a young page to be his fake wife. Then they entertain him with a play. In Padua, we've got Lucentio, a student looking to score some knowledge. He spots Bianca, a cute girl, and decides he's going to woo her. Trouble is, Bianca's already got two other guys drooling over her, Gremio and Hortensio. But her pops, Baptista, says she cannot marry until her older sister, Katharina, is hitched. Lucentio's like, I'm going to be her tutor, and he disguises himself to get close. Old Gremio hires him to woo Bianca for him and even Hortensio pretends to be a musician to get her attention. Lucentio's buddy Tranio dresses up as him to convince Baptista to let him marry Bianca. Meanwhile, this swaggering dude Petruchio shows up. He hears about Katharina who's got a fiery temper. But he's like, I'm gonna tame that shrew with the help of Gremio and Hortensio. Her dad is all for it. cuz Catherine has a handful even though she is resistant petruchio sets a wedding date wedding day comes and it's a whole mess petruchio is super late causing a scene and then they finally tie the knot once they are married petruchio pulls some wild moves he treats katherina terribly denying her food and rest acting like it's it's for her own good she has had enough though and eventually agrees to play by his rules In exchange, she gets to visit her dad. On their trip, they bump into Lucentio's rich dad. Petruchio tests Katharina's obedience, asking her to say weird stuff. They finally get back to Padua and find some more drama. Bianca has got married. Trani has been impersonating Lucentio, and things are a mess. Baptista throws a big wedding feast, and there is a bet to see whose wife is the most obedient. Turns out, Katharina wins, shocking everyone. The play wraps up with the actors leaving and Sly waking up realizing it was all just a crazy dream about taming a shrewish wife. Themes of the play. Relationships. This is an exciting play in that Shakespeare explores the relationship between men and women intensely, more so than in any other play. Conditions of women. The play's central theme is the way women are treated and the effects Baptista has complete dominion over his daughters and dictates everything to them. 
Catherine is tamed by her husband as a wild animal. Men and women are rude and cruel to each other. Even Bianca, the sweet sister, calls her husband a fool. Petruchio is alarmingly hostile to Catherine. It's funny, but Shakespeare is making a serious point. Money. Money and the greed for it is another central theme. Dowries and their size and how much women are worth are featured fam- firmly. Appearance and reality. As usual in Shakespeare, the theme of appearance and reality is strongly expressed. Nothing is what it seems to be. Even the shrewishness of Catherine conceals a compliable nature. Her shrewishness is a reaction to the hurt she feels at the treatment she has received from men. The action is primarily driven by people disguised to conceal their identities and achieve their goals, which are not always what they seem to be.